Hello friends, we have seen in our last video that if you take integers and the fractions between them then this collection is called rational numbers and it is denoted by Q. And which fractions represent rational numbers? A number R is called a rational number if it can be written in the form P by Q where P and Q are integers and Q which is the denominator is not equal to 0. For example 1 by 2 is a rational number where p is equal to 1 and q is equal to 2. How do we find different rational numbers between two numbers? Let us say there are two numbers a and b. So a plus b bracket by 2 reside between them. It's the midpoint, isn't it? Let us take an example. Let's say the two numbers are 4 and 5. So 4 plus 5 by 2 which is 4 plus 5 is 9. 9 by 2 reside at in between 4 and 5. So 9 by 2 is also a rational number. Now we take 4 and 9 by 2 try to find its midpoint so it will become 4 plus 9 by 2 whole bracket by 2 which will be 17 by 4. So now the 17 by 4 is between 4 and 9 by 2. Now we take 4 and 17 by 4 find its midpoint so it becomes 4 plus 17 by 4 the entire bracket by 2 which is equal to 33 by 8. So 33 by 8 is between 4 and 17 by 4. So this way we can keep dividing, finding the midpoints and this method is called mean method or average method to find the center point of two numbers. This way we can find a rational number between any two numbers and we can keep on finding hundreds of rational numbers between any two numbers. Now there is another interesting way to find some rational numbers between 4 and 5. There are fractions between 4 and 5 so we represent 4 and 5 as fraction 2. So we can write 4 as 12 by 3 because 12 by 3 is 4 and we can write 5 with the same denominator 15 by 3 which is also 5. So now between 4 and 5 that is 12 by 3 and 15 by 3 we can find some more fractions like 13 by 3, 14 by 3 right. If we express 4 as 40 by 10 and 5 as 50 by 10 then there can be more rational numbers like 41 by 10, 42 by 10, 43 by 10, 44 by 10 and so on. They will lie between them. If we express 4 as 4000 by 1000 and 5 as 5000 by 1000 then we can find different rational numbers like 4001 by 1000, 4002 by 1000 and so on between them. So this way we can find millions of fractions between any two rational numbers and each of them are also rational numbers.